human children are born with zero instinct for self-preservation. Zero. You have children, yes? How many times have you stopped your child from killing itself? <laughs> many. Don't put your head in the fire. Don't put your head in the fire. Don't put your head in the fire. Don't put your sister's head in the fire. It's endless. No other animal has this problem. Other animal species, their children are born with a modicum of desire to stay alive. <laughs> Not us. Hey, how many of you watch those baby iguanas running away from the snakes? Anybody? Yes. Do you remember? Who got emotionally involved with that? I mean, okay, for who hasn't watched the baby iguanas and the snakes? Yeah. When you go home today, <laughs> you need to Google, just put baby iguanas and snakes, and the next two minutes will seem very funny. <laughs> but for the rest of you, do you remember like one egg broke and the baby iguanas came and they got eaten and another one got eaten? And then remember that one baby that came out of the thing and was like, holy shit. <laughs> do you remember? It was a baby. It was coming out of an egg and it wanted to live. So it was like, oh, I'm going to go back down. <laughs> and then it came back up and it was like, right, this is the moment to run. And do you remember? Did you see it? No. Did you see it? No. Who are these people? <laughs> did you see it? No. Have you seen it? Yes. I'm just, ignore. <laughs> Do you remember when it ran out of that egg? Yeah, and it ran. And I was like, oh my God, it's making a run. And all these snakes came out like the monsoon. It was a snake monsoon. They were like coming from here. And you were like, run, run, baby, run, 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 run. And it ran and ran. And then do you remember when the snakes got it? And they started to wind it around. And you were like, oh my God, I thought it was going to make it. Why did they have to show it? And David Attenborough was like, well, today. And you're like, shut the fuck up, David. <laughs> This baby's dead, and you think, you know, that's, but that's nature, it's cruel. And then this baby took one leg out from like 17 snakes that were winding it up. And do you remember? And it fucking escaped. And it started running. Do you remember that? I was like, run, baby! Run! Take a left! Take a left! Run, baby! I have never ever cheered any of my own children like that in my life. <laughs> and that baby ran and the snakes came and it jumped up and the snake got up, but it jumped and it landed in front of its mother. Do you remember? And you were like, oh. And the mother was like, where have you been? <laughs> Do you remember that? And when I saw that mother, I was like, why is that iguana mother so familiar? And then the baby was like, oh, they ate Sarah. <laughs> they ate Jane. <laughs> and the mother was like, well, Jane and Sarah have a good reason not to be on time. And I was like, oh, fuck, my mother is inside that iguana. <laughs> That's what it was. Because my mother was like that. My mother did not play. My God, when it came to discipline and kids, she did not play. She did not play.